Hello everybody, it's Lotus Moon. Alright, I'm really sorry I'm not using my mic. I'm kind of in the middle of writing a paper. Sweet Celestia, I cannot wait to finally graduate college again. All these papers are driving me insane. Anyway, um, so I know in one of my last readings I said the next story I might read will be something that... Well, it'll be something I wrote. But the thing is, the stories were flashlight stories. Hence why I said that I hope they don't possibly end my audio reading career. Because not many people like the flashlight ship, so... Yeah... I don't know if I'll actually read either one of them as I did two stories like that. The first one is called At the Gala, and it was actually the first um, ship story I wrote on Femme Fiction, which kind of got some negative reviews because, like I said, people don't really like the flashlight ship, and it was kind of rushed, so there's not much really behind it. And the second one is called Twilight's First Valentine, which is an Equestria Girls flashlight ship as it's Twilight spending Hearts and Hoofs Day in, you know, the human counterpart world and everything. I actually wrote that one for me and Sephiris, and I actually have more time to do that one, so it kind of turned out a little bit better, but it's still a flashlight ship nonetheless, so yeah, I just don't want everyone to hate me for reading something like that. Like I also said, I can't really choose which one I might read, and it just makes me nervous. So, there's that, and if I don't read either one of those next, then the next thing I'll read will either be a clop, or a three-part story about Diamond Tiara that I found. Or I'll even let Lily do a reading, since she's been dying to do one pretty soon. Aside from all of that, every pony. I want to thank you all for your patience regarding Inverno and F minor. The next chapter is in production, so that should hopefully hopefully be out pretty soon. I don't know how soon, but it will definitely be out eventually. And lastly, I want to bring up the video I posted a while ago about the audio drama I wanted to make for my own rendition of Little Mermaid. Now, I'm working on the script for the first chapter, and I'm also working on the Google Docs casting call. Um, so I don't know when that'll be up. The latest it might be up will be possibly late August, early September, perhaps. That casting call will be open to voice acting and artists because... And there's probably going to be, well not even probably, there's going to be a lot that'll go into this. So, I already have, after looking over the story again, a general list of characters for main and minor roles. So, I'll have the Google Docs possibly completed maybe within the next two weeks. Because aside from school, I also am working a summer job. So... I need to have time to balance everything out. So maybe when I'm not doing either one of those, I'll work on a Google Docs until it's actually ready. I actually have someone who's helping me out with it too, so that it could look, well, as well, maybe as good as it gets. I'm sorry, every pony. It's hot, and I'm just really frazzled because this paper is due pretty soon. So I guess I should stop rambling and... I don't know, get back to work. Anyway, um, like I said, the Cousin Call video and Google Docs should be released possibly late August, early September. So please be patient, look forward to that. I only say that because at the end of August, school will pretty much end for me, and after that, I'll be free the rest of the year to do more readings, more anime reviews on my other channel if anyone is so interested in those, and just possibly more things in general. So 
once I get the ball rolling for this audio drama, that may not take up my full attention and everything. But definitely once the ball gets rolling and production actually starts, things should hopefully fall into place as best they possibly can. So please have patience. Next chapter for Remember Not F Minor should be released soon. My next reading should hopefully be released sometime this week. And I think that's just about everything I have to say for right now. I am Little Smith and I want to wish you all a good morning, afternoon, evening, or night to wherever you are, every pony. Good night.